welcome back to live updates with t thank you so much for tuning in and thank you so much for joining me if you are new to this channel welcome 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 so we are the winning family and if you'd like to become a part of this family or a member of this family just make sure you hit the subscribe button and also don't forget to turn on your notification bell so you're notified whenever we get to post new videos so guys i'm back with another update as per usual so before we get to that please do let me know in the comment section if you can hear me properly or not because i remember guys when i was still recording behind the scenes i used to have like a lot of problems with sound and right now that i'm in front of the camera i don't want to have any kinds of of sound problems so do let me know in the comment section if you can hear me properly or not by the way i had ordered um a mic from sheen Shein, whatever you call it so i'm actually waiting for it sheen sometimes take its own time so i'm not really sure when it's gonna get here but i it's been i think it's been a week yeah it has been a week since i ordered so i'm not really sure when it's gonna be delivered but um i feel like i'm gonna be more comfortable as soon as um it gets here with i mean i'm gonna be comfortable with the sound problems and stuff so guys let's just get straight to business first of all before we get to you know a lot of things i would just like to congratulations <laughs> okay i just like to say congratulations to tamba broly so tamba just dropped an album today if you don't know now you know Tamba had just dropped an album today called The New Dawn. I am so excited. I haven't listened to any of the songs, you know, because, I mean, it's it's still early and it just dropped today. So I'm going to be dedicating myself, you know, like some time later on in the day just to check out the album. Because also today, guys, I'm just going to, I'm about to do like a lot of series of videos. So I, I, I'm covered, you know, during the week whenever I get busy, you know, and whenever I get occupied. So you guys can at least have something to watch you know from my channel so to, yeah today i'm gonna be doing like a lot of videos and then later on i will you know get a chance Yana, to just listen to the album so congratulations to him guys this is really huge i'm so excited i think most of the songs he might have done them before he even went to the big brother's house because if you remember clearly properly he did mention during the time inside the house that he was um working on like a, 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 an album or something like that he's a singer he's a writer you know and all of that so i'm just thinking that most of these songs he made them even before we knew him so i cannot wait to just you know listen to most of the songs in that album once again congratulations to him and then guys let's move on to this next one this one <laughs> i'm not sure how i feel about this guys i'm not sure if i should cry or laugh or i'm not really sure <laughs> okay i'm not about to cry not at all i'm not really about to cry but um okay let me just write this i mean read this for you guys i will put a screenshot somewhere here so you guys can also you know um know what i what it is that i'm talking about or what i'm listening to you know i'm realizing something because i'm using my phone to shoot and the camera is there and i'm sometimes facing there so please guys like don't mind me when sometimes i'm facing that side and that side because this thing is just too confusing it's just too confusing i know a lot of people would say that no you must shoot you know with the back camera i, I don't feel comfortable with shooting with my back camera because I, I like i don't see myself and i don't even understand what's going on i tried but i failed so please don't mind me guys when sometimes i face that side and sometimes i face that side because the camera is there but yeah i hope you do get it so this is what uh the person said i think this is um Tato Street because this is just a screenshot that I came across. Ne? It's just a screenshot. It's not the actual tweet that I came across. This is just a screenshot that I came across. And the person's reply said, Are you saying we must forget about Devon July pre parties? We have family meeting. And then Tato said, Didn't even know about Devon July pre parties. Only one party matters our high tea party okay this caused a lot of chaos 
at this point i still don't understand i don't get it like people are angry people are angry people are calling tato jealous they are calling tato um evil all of this you know all of this sorts of names they're busy calling her all sorts of names and at this point i'm still confused as to okay what's really going on what am i missing i mean what's the problem is it because she said that her own party is the only party that matters or not but i tried you know uh, digging deeper and researching as to okay why is it that people are angry because it is possible that there is a reason that people are angry and i'm just not away and then i found that most of these pre people who are actually angry are uh, uh a ghost nation you know tambas fans because these days guys it's very much simple to 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 identify them and to see them because of their profile pictures they're actually using uh the new dawn that, that uh picture that the new dawn uh picture if you get me guys if you get me they're actually using that so it's very much um easy to identify them and it's to actually see that it's them so I realized that it's most of these people who are angry are Timber's fans. And only because Timber is actually performing, I think, at the pre-party later today. If you don't know, guys, also, this week is Devon July's weekend, okay? This weekend. It is Devon July's weekend. If you don't know or you have no idea what Devon July is, it's one of the biggest events in South Africa. I mean, we have they haven't been really hosting this event because of COVID the past two years. So this is actually the first time they're hosting it after, um, after um, COVID yeah after covid so yeah hey guys this week it's gonna be busy up and down yo a lot is gonna be happening shame really a lot is gonna be happening and i'm really looking forward to see uh some of the housemates that are gonna be attending obviously some are not gonna be attending i mean tato for example it doesn't seem like she will be attending you know because she also said that she didn't even she knows nothing about uh Devin july pre-parties so it clearly shows that she's definitely not gonna be attending so um yeah guys i mean if you're part of ghost nation i would really love you guys to come forth and explain to us what's okay what's what what the problem is like is it because of the way she said it or it's because she said she knows nothing about Devin july or oh, okay why, why why are you calling her evil and jealous I, i'm not fighting guys i just want to understand because i'm i'm lost i'm really really lost i'm lost and also guys Tamba will be begging a lot of money this weekend remember i also made a video about this that she oh my word he <laughs> he will be hosting at the main event again tomorrow so imagine he's performing at the pre-party he's gonna be hosting tomorrow like jay everything is just gonna be busy you know he's just gonna be securing the bag left right and center and i'm definitely here for it i am super excited for him this is really great news and can we also discuss poor about demo guys that hand is just super 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 supportive to Temba. it's just so amazing guys like it's really amazing can i also just have a partner who's just like supportive like poor but demo is to Temba? like poor is just okay i mean it it is actually the right thing to do in a relationship if you are in a relationship with someone and that person is doing something like a business or something you should be supportive like that's just how it is that's how it like it's supposed to be like that you know you should be supportive so yesterday she posted this and she said it's a new dawn family let's operate this weekend is ghosted if you didn't know now you know so basically she was just hyping Timber's uh upcoming album the one that had just been released like today she was just hyping it you know supporting her man making sure that also ug gang also stream across all the platforms just to support her man so i'm really really proud of her you know yeah um i am actually proud of her you know she's really doing a great thing honestly she is really doing a great thing by supporting a man and also she she hosted um what's this a twitter space this past monday i actually wanted to talk about it but like i said guys i've been so occupied this week 
to a point where I didn't even really have time, you know, to record a lot of videos. So, um, she, she, she hosted like a Twitter space and where she was just, you know, talking about a lot of things and, you know, talking about Temba, obviously, obviously talking about how good of a boyfriend Temba is and all of that, you know, she feels like she's lucky to have him as her boyfriend, you know, and all of that. So she was just basically talking about all of that. But one thing that she spoke about that really shocked me, guys, I know that Mpo is one person who's been through the most and who's been through hell and back. I mean, even during the time in the house, this is something that she used to say that, you know what, she's been through the most in this life she's been through a lot of situations and all of that but one thing that really shocked me it's when she started explaining her ex um boyfriend's behavior that she she was in a very abusive relationship where her ex-boyfriend would even pull up a gun on her and be like if you want to try something crazy I will blow up your brains. I will shoot you and forget about you. And this will be the end of you. And I'm just like, Ooh. Mm -mm. she's really been through a lot, guys. And she's really been through a lot. Love and light to her. You know what? She really deserves the love that Temba is really giving her at this point. Because hearing that story really scared me. Like, that's just really a traumatic, very traumatic experience. So, Nje, that one on its own is just, it's crazy. It's really, really crazy. So, yeah, guys, um, I think I should just have to end my video here. I really have a lot of work to do today. So, let me just end this video here. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for being here. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, turn on your notification bells. What else? What else am I forgetting? Don't forget to watch my ads, guys. Please don't skip. You know how important it is for me, guys. Also, that's just how I secure the bag. That's how I get my coins. So the more you watch my ads is the more I also benefit. So yeah, guys, that will be all. I will see you on my next video. Stay tuned, guys. I'm coming back with another update. Okay. I'm coming back with another video. It might not be a Big Brother Mzonsi update, but I am definitely coming back with another video. For now, it will... Okay, it is a goodbye. I love you so much. Bye.